What's up, everyone? My name is Sunny, and this is Sunny English. Now that I've updated my PTE Describe Image templates, I've made it simplified, much more easier to memorize, with more content, which means fewer words will actually be coming from the image itself. Therefore, I'm going to be uploading my old tutorials for the old templates for free. They were originally for sale on my website, but now you can have the content for free. Take a look at it. It was very helpful. We have had a lot of success with it, but now it's just easier. But if you find the old templates easy to memorize and to adapt to your own speaking, feel free. If you want the latest templates, then go to my website, justassunny.com.au. This video will cover the single bar chart template. By now, you should have the templates downloaded and printed out. So let's go over them together. This is what a single bar chart looks like. There is usually a title above, and the single bar chart will contain data on the X and Y axes. During the 25 seconds, you should identify these three points. The highest, the second highest, and the lowest. Take a look again and pick out those points. Did you pick out these points? I picked 2010 because it was the highest. I picked 2003 because it was the second highest. It doesn't need to be exact. If there is more than one, just pick one. I picked 2007 because it was the lowest. Replace the points in bold with the information you picked out from the single bar chart. Complete the introduction with a noun phrase, or you can just read the title as is. Keep the conclusion as general as possible to avoid overthinking. You do not need to assess the data. As for myself, anytime I see a diagram with time, I will always say something will continue to increase or decrease in the future. It will be okay. Remember, content is the least important part of scoring. You should have your template printed out in front of you. You can see both the bar chart and the script at the same time. Remember to apply rhythm to your speaking. I will read it for you to give you an example, but you can apply your own rhythm. The given bar chart shows the annual government financing. From an overall perspective, we can see that 2010 holds the highest total of financing at 3.5 million pesos, followed by 2003, which holds the second highest total of financing at 2.7 million pesos. In contrast, 2007 holds the lowest total of financing at 870,000 pesos. One thing that clearly stands out is that financing will continue to increase in the future. There you have it. As you see in my conclusion, I just said something will continue to increase in the future. And that something was financing. Were you able to pick out the words where I apply stress? Listen again and practice. Did you find the template helpful? If so, you can rewind the video and copy down the template. If you would like to have the PDF file, it's available on my website, along with the updated and new templates. Please visit justassunny.com.au. There are a total of nine of these videos and I will be uploading all of them. Please hit like and subscribe so you can get the latest updates. My name is Sunny and this is Sunny English.